Hey guys, Joshua here. I know it's been a little while, but uh, definitely worth it. Uh, we're sitting at the uh, start of February here, and uh, yeah, winter's been pretty good. Last few months, or a little while since I've been gone, has just been uh, enjoying winter and uh, everything else that comes with the off season here in Saskatchewan. But uh, today I got a little surprise for everybody. I've had this car for about a year now, and I finally got it home. And uh, yeah, let's take a little look. Nineteen seventy four Planet Duster two twenty five Slant Six. Picked her up from a buddy. A little bit of rest there, weight reduction from there. Not too terrible. Uh, obviously, we're going to give her a fresh paint job. Going to go with the same green. Lots of new parts in it already. Um, yeah, so more videos to come about uh, the duster here. Uh, I just thought I'd give you guys a quick little look. Um, but today on the dock kit is to kind of vacuum up the shop a little bit, get it clean, organized, get the heater running for a little while, uh, kind of get into the back and start doing some fixing on the electrical that was all chewed up a little bit. Uh, it's not too terribly cold out today, about minus five. Uh, it's supposed to keep warming up as the day progresses here. Uh, I got a heater over there. And then one right there. And then I'll run headlamps and other lamps just to keep the electrical cost down because those heaters are, uh, I believe, like a one, uh, 1500 volt, not volt, sorry, uh, but that's how much power they draw. Uh, it's, uh, don't wanna run up the cost too much. Uh, but yeah, I'll, uh, once I get going here, I'll open up the car and uh, get it cleaned out a bit more and yeah, take another look. So we'll touch back in a little bit here. All right, so we got everything open. And what we're gonna do right now is get all this stuff cleaned out. Get the heater there, it's not running right now for the sake of noise and I got that light on. And uh, when I use that heater and that heater, that means I go to headlamps and uh, other light sources. Uh, just keep the cost down uh, because I'm not a millionaire, believe it or not, um, maybe one day, uh, that's the old retirement plan at least. Um, anyways, and then the inside here, got all this cleaned up. As you can tell, these aren't the original seats because they were green, but these are original. Uh, they were not savable, the original ones that were in here. They were torn apart, really awful, disgusting, smelly. Oh, pretty good. Um, so I got these ones, but these are from them. These are the only savable things. And uh, the plan for the car is to be a green on green on white with the white stripe coming down the side and then the white interior a little bit there. But other than that, yeah, get this thing cleaned up. And uh, yeah, touch base with you guys in a little bit and vacuum it and then uh, pop the hood. Yeah, we'll touch back in a few minutes. Well, <laughs> not a few minutes, that's gonna be a lot longer than that. <laughs> All right, update. So, getting ready to Vacuum that out. And getting ready to vacuum the duster. Just gotta pick up a few more things. Move a few more things. Yeah. Coming along just nice. So, update. We're pretty much done. Take a gander at it. Vacuumed. Both seats vacuumed, nice and clean, cleaned up of all the gunk, and on a much warmer day, I'm going to get some uh, cleaner specific for this stuff and uh, kind of give a good scrub down to get all that gunk off. I also have a, a steam cleaner inside that uh, I'll use also on a, probably a warmer day because we're still in winter. Um, today luckily is minus one, tomorrow's plus two which is rare because it's February. Um, and we're probably going into a plunge of a few more weeks of some cold, and then hopefully spring is starting up eventually. But let's keep going around. Got the trunk nice and set. As you can see, a little bit. 
put all that stuff away nice and neat. She taking out her gander on this side. Oh, I forgot to put that down. So I gotta still do a bit more under here. I gotta take the seats back out and kind of pull all that out, all the carpeting out under here. Uh, I gotta redo the floors. What's happening this year? What was that? Huh. There we are. Yeah. I'll open that up for you guys too, so you can see what's uh, how much gunk we pulled out. But some stuff I found when I was cleaning all of these doll like old coins, and some of these old newspaper. I'll open it up and uh, see what they are. Pretty neat. Uh, I can't start it for you guys today, unfortunately. Um, I have to get a new push rod. Oh, that was my head on the garage door. <laughs> Gosh darn it. So, there she is. Leaning Tower Power Slant 6 225. She does sound good when it's operating correctly. Carb rebuild, everything really. She's done... Done quite a lot to it. But yeah, in the coming days, uh, weeks or so, I'll get that push rod put in and uh, stir it up for you guys. That'd be nice. There we are. Yeah. So, hope you guys enjoyed that video and the little walk around of my uh, duster. Again, that's the uh, 1974... Plymouth Duster 225 Slant 6. More to come on this girl, that's for sure. Cool. Bonus video, I almost forgot. Oh, it's a lot of crud. A lot of crud. <laughs>